Kevin, what were your first thoughts when you knew Dennis couldn't go and knew you were going to have to start? Uh, I knew probably two days ago he went down with his ankle injury, so um, I had some time to prepare, which was a good thing. Um, got my nerves right and got ready to go. Um, what I thought was, you know, well, I probably won't score like Dennis, but I have to create plays for other guys. I think Truck and Katie did that tonight. You took the ball right at their defenders a couple times in the first half to score. Was that important for you to kind of establish that, that you just weren't out there to fill space? Yeah, something I've been working on, trying to be more aggressive throughout practice, and now trying to translate that to the game. You're one of the guys on the team last year. How much does this win help you guys get back in the Uh Yeah, we we got revenge on Marshall, which is a good thing. And they're a good team. I think they're in the top uh, top 40 in the RPI, so it's a huge win for us. Um, and we show that we're the best team in the state again. Did y'all change the way you defended the high ball screens against the threes in the second half? Uh, no, no. We The only change we made was... Uh, doing what we're supposed to do. We weren't doing that in the first half. We are supposed to be up the line and, and, and getting in front of those ball screens before the guy even gets there. We weren't doing that in the first half, and I think we just um, we corrected that in the second half. Kevin, how much did you hear about their rebound? That was all we heard about all week. Uh, they've rebounded every opponent they've played. Um, that was our goal to, to all rebound. I'm not sure if we did or not. but I think you did. Um, and, and, you know, Coach said if we, we do that, we'll win. Kevin, knowing that when Dennis goes down, did it, did it feel like it was putting you guys behind the eight ball, or were you guys just the same as any other game going in? Uh, you know, Dennis is a good player. He's a great player, and he's a good presence in the post. Um, he takes some pressure off KJ. Uh, but, yeah, you know, we have confidence in each other, and, and any one of us can step up at any time and, and, and take his place if needed. Kevin, you said that you did have time to prepare for it. But, I mean, did you feel anything different about coming, you know, being there at tip-off rather than coming off the bench? That was a good feeling. I just felt like, oh, I'm finally here. I, I, I got my goal. I'm, I'm starter for the game. Um, you know, that's something I'm proud of right now, but now I'm just focused on Cincinnati. Was this an emotional ride for the team tonight at all? Uh, you know, we, everyone said it's Marshall Super Bowl. I think it's – coach was saying this is our Super Bowl. We, we needed this one, and, and we got it done. So, you know, our, our nerves were high, our emotions were high, but – the outcome speaks for itself. You could see the emotion from you guys on the court. I mean, for you specifically to have had a, a solid game and, and you know, come out with the win, I mean, what does this mean to have done it in a start? Uh, it means we have, you know, we can do, we really do anything we want if we, if we pass the ball and play as a team. Um, you know, we didn't have Dennis tonight, so we had to play as a team. We, we had to pass it more. We had to get, uh, get Truck and KJ more looks, and, and, and we did that through unselfish play and selfish passing. I saw a lot of screens for Truck. One thing we noticed was that they, they didn't hedge very well, and Truck was able to come off those screens and knock down shots. And with KJ, we they, we noticed they don't front in the post. We were able to dump it in, dump it in there every time to him, and he finished or got fouled every time.